leader. Meteorologist Sean Everson with your accurate weather now forecast. Well, a scorching 4th of July on the way. Heat advisory in effect area wide through the rest of today and through tomorrow. Feels like temperatures climbing well into the triple digits here this afternoon. So be smart, be safe as you're out celebrating for the 4th of July. Make sure you're finding some shade, some AC breaks inside and make sure you're drinking plenty of water or at least mixing water in impact weather. The heat advisory in effect now by 1 o'clock or up to 92 feels like 100 5 o'clock. See, feels like 105 and even for fireworks time after sunset, we're still going to be humid temperatures in the upper 80s. This is after we had quite a bit of rain overnight, close to an inch here at Epley Airfield. Those storms now pushing well off to the east. The showers lifted. Now the clouds moving out as well. So we're seeing a lot more sunshine right now and give it 10 hours and this camera, you'll see all the fireworks lighting up across the city right now. 89 degrees, but feels like 97. Look at the dew point in the low 70s. That's disgusting. Muggy meter today. Yeah, it's miserable. You're going to be sweating a lot if you're going to be outside here uh, throughout the entirety of the afternoon and evening. 97, what it feels like in Omaha, 101, Maryville, 96, Lincoln, 95, and Fremont. At least we do have a bit of a south breeze stirring up the air a little bit. So wind will be gusty at times through the rest of the afternoon, but you see those heat next values climbing 102, 105 through 5, 6 o'clock. So we've got to be very careful if you're going to be outside for a prolonged period of time heading to some of those parades. Again, find some shade. Even at night, not much relief from the heat. Those uh, temperatures still staying in the 80s most of the night. Here's storm predictor. The clouds up to the north lifting. There we go into the upper 90s. Still fairly clear. Uh, as we go after sunset for fireworks, though, expect uh, air quality may drop with all the uh, the smoke from displays by tomorrow morning, starting off in the upper 70s, and then we make another run into the upper 90s and perhaps hit that century mark by four or five o'clock. And then we'll see storms up to our north try to drop south, but better chances for storms in the Omaha Metro will come after sunset overnight and a few of those could be on the stronger side, especially north of the metro. The slight risk here could produce some storms producing large hail damaging wind gusts really after seven, eight o'clock and again here in the metro a little bit later. So high heat heat advisory today and tomorrow and even with those storms moving through overnight into Wednesday, a front moving through not really going to get relief from the heat.